the main questions which I've been tasked with asking you. Uh, can you introduce yourself for the voters watching at home? Sure. I'm Eric Spandy and I'm running as the Democratic candidate for the Forest Preserve District 6 position, uh, the June 28th primary, and then of course the general election on the 28th. Uh, what I would like to do as the uh, Forest Preserve Commissioner is work hard to restore the national environment, do more to make sure the infrastructure for amenities are in good shape, make sure that we have good staff relations since our staff are the reasons why we have all the good amenities uh, that are provided for us and of course be a good fiscal steward because of course we're entrusted with about 70 million dollars a year we need to make sure that's managed appropriately and uh, efficiently Do you have to make you stand out for this position? Okay. Well, I am a uh, environmentalist that can do math. My background is that an environmental scientist working for a Fortune 500 in engineering company for the last 30 fun-filled and exciting years. I'm also a trail advocate. I'm the president of the Illinois Prairie Path Not for Profit Corporation, and have been doing the uh, trail advocacy for the last 20 years. I'm also a component of education. I do a lot of outreach to local schools, such as School District 200 a number of years ago, School District 34, and the Edison Gifted School, talking about environmental and trail issues. I also have a background as the former mayor of the village of Winfield in building trails. We partnered with the Forest Preserve, also with the County of DuPage to build two brand new trails and a new $1.8 million Riverwalk Park, including a pollinator garden and also wetland restoration. So with all of those, the, the background and including the fact that I started our stormwater committee, also our bikeways group as a co-founder, I co-founded a community garden in the village of Winfield, uh, and also installed a couple of rain gardens in the uh, school district 34. So uh, I bring a lot to the table and I ask for your vote. All right, question number three, what policies, projects, or ideas will you implement, will you implement should you be elected? The new idea I'd like to bring to the Forest Preserve is a infrastructure management system. When I was village president of Winfield, we had a problem. Our roads were falling apart and in bad shape. Uh, what we did is we put all of our infrastructure and we managed it separately, including a, a, a rating system, and then also trying to figure out what is it gonna cost on a five and 20 year plan. What this did allowed us to control our costs, project forward to see where our cost liabilities were gonna do be, and then made us be a much more efficient organization. I noticed the Forest Preserve is not doing that right now, and the Forest Preserve is a lot bigger than the village of Winfield, which is 10,000 people. There would be a lot of value in understanding what our responsibilities are, what we need to do, and what our long term financial obligations will be. All right, how will you engage the community and get them excited about nature? I think our commissioners for the Forest Preserve need to be ambassadors for the Forest Preserve. And the types of things that I've done in the recent past, this last fall I did a citizen tour of the Winfield Mounds and the Winfield Mounds Forest Preserve, speaking to its history, all the trails that are associated with it, the environment going back, uh, and also the archaeology going back about 10,000 years. Uh, on July 12th, I'm actually doing a tour of the Winfield Riverwalk Pollinator Garden, and then also speaking to some of the wetland restoration we've done there, and then why that's a value both to our communities and our environments in terms of how it can uh, help us all on an individual basis, and more importantly, what individual people can do in their own homes and take some of those uh, advantages and then replicate them for themselves for the community benefit of the wider community. If commissioners can do that sort of outreach, bringing their own skills and talents, and then doing outreach to both help people understand and then also to listen, I think that will be a long-term advantage for the Forest Preserve, and that's what I would advocate both for me, certainly, and then also for other commissioners. All right, the final main question I has I have for you is, is there anything else you would like to cover that you didn't get a chance to say already? Um, well, what I'd like to say is that it almost is like I've been preparing for this type of role my entire life based on my background as a scientist, based on the work I've done for the uh, uh, Village of Winfield as its previous village president, all the volunteer work that I've done through the years, and then also the ability of what I call systematic innovation. When I was village president, and I became president, the village was a mess. It was financially on its knees, 40% of the roads were in poor to failing conditions, the, citizen, the, citizen, the entire village was in, in an uproar because of controversy. By the time I was done, the finances were fixed, 
I, we, we went from being an embarrassment to winning innovation awards that were granted by my other fellow mayors, which I thought was astounding, building huge, a very expensive infrastructure by partnerships with the Forest Preserve and the county, and then also finding a way to get more amenities by partnering with the biggest hospital, Central DuPage Hospital, and then we partnered with them not only to build the Riverwalk Park, but also to spur development throughout the entire village. What I, what I believe I bring to the table is innovation, cooperation, partnerships, and a way to understand and find solutions to difficult problems. And I certainly would appreciate everyone's support. Thank you very much. All right, and now we do have some alternative questions uh -oh. for you. Oh, but, you're uh, gonna uh, grill me? Elisa's the one asking them, so she will be grilling you. Oh, okay, very good. Yeah.